the old school way of uh, treating water in the cooling tower. There is another way, and a cleaner way, a greener way, easier on the building, easier, actually easier on the engineers. Everybody uses chemicals, either a dry or a wet chemical. So uh, this was pretty much new to the uh, the industry. So everybody was kind of gun shy. It was uh, we, we was like we were thinking it was smoke and mirrors. There's that great reluctance to try that new thing. Um, does it really work that well? Uh, and I think we're a testament to saying yes, it does. It's why Lerner has us on every one of their buildings that has a cooling tower. It's why W.C. Smith is specifying us on all of their new construction. It's why Car Properties has us on the first five of their buildings. It's why we're taking care of the cooling towers at the Willard Intercontinental. It's why the Society for Human Resources Management and the National Association of Convenience Stores has us installed on the cooling towers at their respective headquarters. It's why Stellati has begun installing us too. Vendors like AquaG and others who have said, look, we've done, the, we've, our whole lives we've done uh, traditional water treatment methods and now we, you know, we're actually, you know, drinking the Kool-Aid, so to speak, of the silver bullet and, and there's a reason behind that. It's not because, they, you know, they weren't profitable in their other uh, endeavors. They see the value of this and they see this as being the future. I'm recommending to all of my customers that I can convert over to this system to get away from the chemicals, the handling of the chemicals. It's a very si simple thing to do. The motivation for us was uh, being able to, first of all, to investigate the uh, possibility of doing away with all chemicals in our water treatment system. I've had a, a rather bad experience with a couple other uh, chemical companies that uh, um, damaged the building. There was a smell of uh, uh, the chlorine and the chemicals was bad. It just gave it a bad feeling in the building and uh, wasn't quite doing what, uh, what you know, they claimed that they would do. Biocides are dangerous. Um, there's an isothiazolin on, that's on the market. Aquagy doesn't use it, but some of the companies do. Highly effective, very toxic. If you get uh, isothiazolin on you, um, once it's in your system, it never leaves. We'll leave the property unnamed, but uh, 15, 20 years ago, uh, came into work with a nightmare that the water treatment company at that time uh, their pumps had uh, somehow spilled their treatment chemicals into our main bus duct system. That is the main electrical high voltage uh, service for the building. We literally had to evacuate the building immediately, shut that down, get that water treatment company to come in, fix their equipment. And people don't think it's broke because it takes 20 to 30 years to have problems a lot of times, but when you have those problems, they're major. So uh, with the first uh, first opportunity to get on with Silver Bullet, I was, I was really happy to step up and say, let's try it. The old system with the chemicals and stuff, um, I can really say that it was the top of the line system, and I really, I had faith in it. We left the old system in and brought the new system in, and we even had the old system, the people with the old system, come in and double check our chemicals. All the readings were spot on, and they couldn't believe it either. So then we uh, got rid of the other system and moving forward with Silver Bullet. <laughs> There's nothing to haul around. There's no chemicals to handle. We mount a unit on a wall. We connect our uh, pumps that are in the unit along with our uh, processor that makes the uh, ions for the hydrogen peroxide. And that's it, we carry that residual in the tower and that uh, works wonders. So you have the benefit of non-scaling and um, also you have the benefit of bacteria control. Silver Bullet has, has uh, eliminated the, uh, the bacteria in the tower from their treatment. The hydrogen peroxide has been used to fight bacteria on cuts and wounds for years and years and years. So we cover corrosion, we cover scale, we cover bacteria and we increase water cycles. All the other systems out there that I know of, they can't touch all the bases. And a lot of them are a lot more expensive. And you own them. You don't own the unit from Silver Bullet. You basically rent it. You're not happy with it, send it back. 
we thought that Silver Bullet would be a good fit for us for our green initiatives, uh, a sustainable program that got rid of the, t the toxic chemicals that we were using, as well as to save energy and electric. We, uh, we like I said, we, we, we scrutinized it very closely for about a year. Um, after that, we uh, analyzed results and um, decided we'd roll it out to the rest of the portfolio. We use less water. Uh, I think we're, um, we've uh, increased to six, some, sometimes seven cycles of uh, concentration. Uh, I believe we were at one and a half to two. Uh, we were dumping quite a bit of water on the uh, uh, blowdown due to trying to keep the, uh, the chemicals and the chemistry, everything suspended. It, it, was a, it, was, it was costly. It was costly for the building, costly for the owner, and fortunately, you know, costly for the tenants. We're not using all the water we were using before. Um, but the, the cooling tower, uh, we don't have to come in on weekends and clean it as much, so we spend more time home with our families. I, I was sold by the fact of the, uh, the Silver Bullet, just in the performance and, and, and uh, reducing scale. Before Silver Bullet, we had our conventional system in place. Uh, we did have some scale in the system. The, the, the test profile was uh, 2007 turnover. Um, at that time, we had some scale in the system. We had some condensers that were fouling. After an introducing the silver bullet, we have not had to acid clean anything, and uh, the, the system's been doing very well since then. I've been here for a year, and we haven't, we haven't done a, an old-fashioned cleaning of the cooling tower in the last 12 months, so, and that wouldn't be the case in a, in a, in a traditional treated tower. Our engineer brought to me an example where a kind of louver that was full of corrosive material, um, he would take that and just submerse it in the water and it basically cleaned itself, I'll say it from that perspective. Um, so those types of, of cleaning and maintenance that we are no longer obligated to do off hours, creating overtime work, that type of thing, um, is, is basically what, I, what I'm referring to as far as the savings that we're seeing. Uh, I have a, a better transformation of heat and reduction, uh, transfer of heat through the, uh, through the uh, uh, system with cleaner water. And, and everybody knows when your uh, heat exchangers scale up, you get a uh, bad delta temperature and uh, that's sort of subsequently, you know, transferred into higher energy uses and, and more water. We did a preliminary cost savings and analysis and it looked like it's a good possibility the first year we could save thirty thousand dollars so uh, chemical use alone. The biggest thing though that I know for sure is we've had a fifty percent reduction in our monthly invoice from Silver Bullet versus our prior uh, water treatment company. This just made sense in that there wasn't a great capital outlay. We didn't have to look at an overall return on investment uh, what we're just seeing is basically a decrease in month-to-month -month expenses. And the installation is so easy, you can get one system installed in a matter of an hour or two and uh, have it up and running before the, you know, before noontime. So installation, sales, support, uh, shipping of, of uh, whatever the product is, very smoothly done. It was a matter of, of a day, you know, uh, rolling out. They'd roll out several buildings a day, actually, but within 30 days, we had our entire portfolio rolled out. A lot of people aren't open to change. Uh, they know something works, and they're not, uh, some people aren't adventurous uh, or have the thorough understanding of what certain things are and, and what the benefits are. So it's easier to say no. It's always been easier to say, no, I'm not interested. Oh, I don't know if that's going to work. Oh, why, why, how, how, all those questions. Engineers need to open up to the new um, technologies. We know you've got questions, concerns. You're worried about the risk. How about we take care of that risk for you? We'll do this for the same price you're paying for water treatment today. No long-term commitment, monthly service agreement, no capital expenditure. And for 120 days, you can try us risk-free. We'll guarantee your equipment. We'll do a better job. You can do the coupon tests. Make sure we're taking care of your system. You can see how we're descaling. You can look at the dip slides and see that we're a better buy aside. If you don't like it at, end, at the end of 120 days, I'll bring you a check, remove the system myself.
uh, working with the Silver Bullet team has, has certainly been first rate. We've interjected this to all, all of our properties and we're seeing good results. I'm saying I'm drinking a Kool-Aid, probably about a gallon now. Really, it's a no-brainer. If everybody did it, I think we'd be ahead of the game. <laughs> An earth-friendly, a green kind of a path that we can certainly uh, help our children and our grandchildren by reducing or eliminating chemicals. It is been 100% everything I expected. At the end of the day, when you see the results um, and you see where, you know, last month they had to come in on a Saturday and Sunday and do cleaning, and this month we don't have to because the product is taking care of all of that, uh, it allows you to just basically say, you know, I wish we would have done this a year ago. Are you still here? You should be making a phone call so that we could be installing tomorrow.